Hello and welcome to the world of Pisces. Pisces, I hope that you all are radiating positive energy at this time. Let's hop into it, get the universal message and see how you guys are doing on your soul's journey. All right, there we are, Pisces, and we have recycle, recover, and the bag says hello again, okay? So this is about cycles, Pisces. This is about karmic cycles returning to your life, right? Know if you do the same thing, you're going to get the same results. If you do something different, you can change your situation. You can change your whole life. Okay, but something has a return that you may not have recovered from, something you may need to recover from, something you may need to learn a lesson on. It's coming back around. Okay, so cycles. Hello again. This could be a person that's coming back or this could be a situation that's manifesting itself right back into your life. You got to learn from it or, or, you know, move on. All right, so that's the universal message. The cycle is making its way back around. Okay, 21, the letter, the number 21 may be relevant to somebody. All right, so let's check up on the energy of your person, Pisces. Let's see how they may, oh, let's see who has secret emotions for you. Okay, let's see who has secret emotions for Pisces. Who needs to, who wants to speak to Pisces and tell them how they feel, but they don't. Okay, let's see who is this person and what secret emotions do they have for you. Endings might bring better beginnings, right? So this is something that ended with someone and they want to, <laughs> hello again, they want to start a new cycle. Okay, so this could be a past person. An ex that wants to have a new beginning with you. Who has secret emotions for Pisces? If only there were a time machine to bring us back to those beautiful memories. If only there was a time machine to bring us back to those beautiful memories. So whoever this person is that wants to start this new cycle with you, they 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 think about the good times that y'all share together. They thinking about all the wonderful memories. They not thinking about what separated y'all. Okay? No doubt you are the one and only I want to spend the rest of my life with. Mm. So whoever this person is, they in it for the long haul. You know what I'm saying? This person want to come back and get you and sweep you off your feet. I hope you single. Because this person seemed like the type of person that, you know, take charge, take control. Not uh, You know, not really accepting no for an answer. Someone who wearing their heart on their sleeve, pure emotional person about you uh, vulnerable when it comes to you right this person got a lot of love for you okay so who has secret emotions for pisces i think i have seen you in my dreams before this feeling is strangely pulling me towards you so this person feels you and they soul they feel like they have a special type of connection with you and their destiny is to have you like you're supposed to be a part of their life. That's how they feel. OK, so, wow, this person got a lot to say, Pisces. Who is this person that has secret emotions for Pisces? And this might bring better beginnings. So all this person is thinking about is restarting the cycle, saying hello again. Right. Maybe there's a lot of unfinished business with this person. Maybe that's what the universe is saying on your soul's journey, Pisces. Hello again, right? There's some unfinished business with this person. Endings might bring better beginnings, okay? So let's see. Okay? Has a lot of potential to be solid, something strong. Has a lot of potential to grow. 
right? When you deal with the pinnacles, you have to have patience though, right? So this could be a patient person, Pisces. This could be an earth sign coming towards you or an ex that you had or someone from your past that's coming and they coming to make a solid offer. And it, the universe is saying this connection has a lot of potential. Endings might bring better beginnings. Let's see what else comes with this. The five of wands in the reverse. Okay. So this person is coming in peace, Pisces. Whoever this past person is, whoever returned into your life, they not coming with no drama or no competition. They coming with a solid offer. Something that has the potential to grow into something grand. Okay? The Eight of Pentacles. Somebody who has skills. Somebody who's focused. Okay? Somebody who's successful. Okay? Somebody who knows how to build and lead. Okay? Someone who's more focused this, this time around and actually has something to offer and actually bring a sense of peace to your life or, or, or kill the chaos that's in your life. This person is coming to kill the competition, right? Like I said, I hope you single because this past person don't seem like they taking no for an answer. They very strong, okay? Very strong person. They may be muscular or or toned, okay? If there were a time machine to bring us back to those beautiful memories. So this person only thinks about the good in you and the good times that y'all share. They don't think about the negativity. So they on a positive note, okay? So this person only thinking about the good times, right? The death card. And something changed. Right? It ended. And ever since the ending, they only think about the good times you had, not the bad times. This person has forgiven themselves, forgiven the situation. Right? They accepted it for what it was so that they can remember the beautiful things about it. Which, which is the two of cups. They think about the wonderful relationship that on um, from their perspective, they think about the wonderful things that, that this relationship brought to their life. And when it ended, it changed them. Okay. So you could be dealing with a Scorpio. So this person only thinking about the good times, right? The recover. Right? They come in to recover. They come in to fix this relationship. They come in to heal this. Okay? Because look, on the soul's journey, recycle, recover. Four, four of uh, swords. It's recovery mode. You know what I mean? So this person is coming to try to recover this relationship. Right? They come in to recover the relationship because they only think about the beautiful things that happen within it. And they go, they want to heal it. Whatever it is, they want to heal it, right? They come in to make a solid offer. They very focused. They very stable. They ready for commitment. They not coming with no drama. You know, they come in peace, right? No doubt you are the one and only I want to spend the rest of my life with. So this is somebody who may want to marry you, especially starting off with those pinnacles. Very committed. OK, so let's see. They want to spend the rest of their life with you, Pisces. King of Wands, they want something steady. OK, they want to put the chaos behind y'all. Whatever went on in the past, they want to leave it in the past. They want to start a new cycle. They want to start off fresh. They want to heal whatever was right they looking for something long and successful with you, right? This person is looking for the better, accepting what happened because it's looking directly at the death card. This king of wands is looking directly at this death card, right? This person 
is wanting to put the past behind and, and work towards a better future. They want something stable. Look, Queen of Cups at the bottom. They want to nurture this situation back to health. They want you to open your cup back up to them. Because they want to spend the rest of their life with you here. Pisces, this person wants to make you happy. Making you happy makes them happy. Being with you makes them happy. Seeing you makes them happy. Hearing you speak makes them happy. Everything about you, they're satisfied with it. That's why they want to spend the rest of their life with you. That's why they want to have something stable and put the chaos behind us. Right? Because they only think about the good things that you brought to their life. The good things you said to them. The way you took care of them. Everything you ever did with for them, with them, they feel like it was all good. No matter how this relationship ended, everything was good with me and Pisces. And that 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 that's what warms my heart. That's why I'm so satisfied. That's why I can see myself spending the rest of my life with you because you're a good person. You was good to me. And now here I am ready to plan my future with you. And I'm already headed in your direction. Okay? So this is somebody who's planning to have a life with you, a, a, a committed, serious relationship. Last but not least, we have, I think I've seen you in my dreams before. This, this feeling is strangely pulling me towards you, right? So they are already taking steps to coming towards you. So this is somebody who has secret emotions for you, right? This is somebody who who's still in love with you and they hoping for a new beginning here and they don't care why we end it. I just care about where we begin. Where do we go from here? Right? Very calm person. Okay. So I think I've seen you in my dreams before. This feeling is strangely pulling me towards you. And that comes with the Queen of Swords. Now, the Queen of Swords is going to tell you what it is, what they want, what they expect, and, and, and how they want to move forward. So this person is coming in their rawest form. They come in pure, and they come in to speak their truth. They not about to play with you. They not about to sugarcoat it. They come in to tell you exactly what they want. And what they want is to have a committed relationship with somebody they love. Right? So that Queen of Swords, they not about to play. Like I said, I felt like this is the type of person that doesn't want to take no for an answer. This is someone who wants you to be totally honest too. Right? They don't want you bullshitting them or trying to sprinkle a little glitter on it. They want you to be honest with them because they're honest with you. They didn't come to play. Right? There's something that's pulling them towards you. And they just got to know the real. It's like, I just got to know. I just got to have you. Right? And if you need some time, I'm willing to wait for you. Right? Remember I was saying, I hope you single. This ain't the type of person that's willing to take no for an answer. This person going to be persistent. This person going to... Keep in contact. They're going to keep texting. They're going to keep working you till you say yes. If you have someone else, they're willing to wait, whatever it takes. You're their person. In their mind, you are it. You are it. Wow. Let's get one more here, Pisces. Oh, that Queen of Cups came back out. Just like a gentle person but they strict they strong they passionate they're hard they're soft they're they're amazing <laughs> they everything right they know how to be a chameleon they know how to change they it's just like they're stern but loving okay they're stern but loving this person wants to take care of you Pisces they want to have you in their heart they want to have you with them they just want you to open up that cup back to them they want you to open your cup of love back up to them 
What's crossing all of it is the Six of Cups. They only think about the good things. This was just crossing their energy. The good things, the good moments that you all shared. Right? Everything that y'all had. They just wish they had a time machine to bring back all those beautiful moments and those beautiful memories. So this is someone I feel is just genuine and pure with their heart. But they're very strong. They're no pushover. They're serious about what they feel. So I hope this resonated, Pisces. Let's get a word from the chakra wisdom to promote positivity, to see what chakra needs to be worked on, or to simply get an inspirational quote that we can say to ourselves each and every day. All right, Pisces, you have the third chakra, and it's the solar plexus chakra. And this one is relevant to inner harmony. I trust my inner wisdom and respond accordingly. I do not allow my mind to create doubt or override my strong gut feelings. I accept and express my feelings while accepting the feelings of others. I am at peace with myself and those around me, and I do not harbor unrealistic expectations of myself or of others. I release the need to control others. My personal power is free from ego and free from any desire to manipulate or exploit situations or people. The foundation of my thoughts and actions is trust in myself. So inner harmony is our positive of energy. If you're new to my channel and you like this video, go ahead, hit that like or subscribe button. For those of you who are returning, thank you for your continued support and remember that your comments are always welcome. This is all I have, Pisces. As always, be safe, be blessed, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.